Hi, this is Stephanie Pickard with Guitar Control, and today I want to go over some parts of Sweet Emotion by Aerosmith. As always, there's tabs below to help you follow along, so let's get started. <laughs> the verse sounds like this. So for the first part, instead of doing a full D chord, I lift up my middle finger and I'm doing a D5, so it's just a root and a fifth. I have my pointer on the third string, second fret, and I have my ring finger on the second string, third fret, and I'm hitting the fourth string open, which is a D. So strings forward and two is what I'm strumming. So I go to an A5 where I'm holding down the fourth and third strings on the second fret and I'm having that open A for the A5 chord. So I go D5, A5, A5, and I kind of slap my, my hands against the guitar to kind of karate chop and mute and give it that kind of jumpy sound. So let's try that together. really cool fill. I start with a pull off where I have my finger pressed down adding pressure to the fifth string third fret and then I just drag my finger off instead of picking to make the noise for the open note. And then I go to the sixth string third fret, I play that G note and then I come back to the open fifth string and then back to the G just like this. And I can do that while my finger's down holding that A5. My pointer really stays kind of in the same place, right? The biggest movement is when it jumps from the third string to hold down the fourth and third string. But then I can just transition really easily back into that D5. And then that's all that I do for the verse, so I keep repeating that over and over. Consider the bridge, and it sounds like this. Straight back into. So let's take a closer look at that. So on the fifth string, I pull off again, and I'm pulling off five to three. I have the pressure for my first finger on the third fret, fifth string that whole time. And then I pick up my ring finger and place on the 6th string 3rd fret. Then on the 6th string I go open, 2, 2, 3, 3, 3, 4, 4, 5. alternate picking, which you do want to do because it's always faster. So I'm going. So the next part, everything just gets one hit. Same pull off lick and then open two, three, four, five. back into our verse. So let's put these two 
riffs together. So here's the chorus and the very last part we'll go over. a little slower. First time's different than the rest for the chorus. The very first time I start it like this. Open fourth string, pull off three to zero on the fifth string. Then I use my pinky, I use my middle finger there um, on the third fret. Then I use my pinky to pull off five to open on the fourth string. So open fourth string, three to open, pull off on the fifth string. And then I go to the fourth string, five zero. Then I do a double stop on the 4th and 3rd strings in the 2nd fret, twice, and then I use my pinky on the 5th fret, 5th string, to go pull off to 0, and then bend down the 3rd string. So every other time after that first one where you go like this, start with an A5, so an A, open A power chord, and then I go 5 to open on the 4th string. And then an open fifth string. So A5 power chord every other time. Then I go five open pull off on the fourth string. Open fifth string, double stop, and then it's the same ending. So all together. together. Thank you so much for watching. As always, there's tabs below to help you follow along. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, check out our website www.guitarcontrol.com and stay tuned for more videos soon. See ya!